see the signs. Oops. Actually, we're getting shorter. Mm-hmm. And shorter and shorter. Mm -hmm. I'm in trouble now. Because he's turned that thing on again. <laughs> I like the dew on top. Yeah. <laughs> I like this look. Let's keep this. Lock it in. Not done with you yet. Not finished. Nope. Oh. Serena, do you like this one? Is it nice? Definitely. Yeah? <laughs> it's so crazy. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Uh oh. No, there's no fear today. <laughs> I'm super chilled. I feel super. like because we know short is just rocket, and we know it's going to look good, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. So I think there's a little bit of ease there, but I just don't know what the end result is going to be. Oh, we shall see, huh? But Sheba is coming back. Do we like guys? What are we thinking? You think I should keep it like that? Hey, Miss So, if I saw that. <laughs> I don't think we're gonna stay quite like this. How old am I? Oh my goodness, I don't know. Well, I'm not 18. And I'm not 53 like you, Jerry. I probably look older than you, but I am not 53. I don't know, let's take some guesses. How old is Sheba? The person that gets the closest gets, what should they get? Jerry, what's our prize for the closest guess in age? A free haircut. A, fr a free haircut? What? <laughs> Thank you. 
No, I'm not 35, guys. Guys! 45? No! No! 37, no. Yes, David, you are. You are correct. I Well, I am 31. I don't know if I want to share that information. But you now know. 29, thank you. Buzz cut feed, yes, 29, you're nice. Seven. <laughs> no, I'm 31, guys. I'm 31. After this haircut, you'll be like 25. 25, take some years off. Yeah, Lindsay, the, the plane fare could be a little pricey for your free haircut. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that's fine. I think they're going to save this live. Management, we want to save this live. Can we do that, Serena? Serena? Okay. Mama, can we save this live? Some people are... Yeah, we're going to save it. Okay, we're going to try and save it for you. Yes, buzz cut feed. Forever young, 23 years old with a buzz cut. Okay, well, we're going to shave those years away, right? Um, I think we're going to do a bit of video editing as well later for this. So we're going to have another cool video. Um, yeah, that uh, we'll be able to release later. But yeah, we'll keep this, this live if you want a little bit of um, inspiration with your next haircut. And we're going to do an awesome photo shoot after this, which should be exciting. I always love working with the team. The concepts are amazing. We're able to really um, creatively build cool things together. So that's coming up next. Uh, I don't think we'll be live for that, but you totally have to check in on the account and you'll be able to see all the images as they roll them out. Okay, as soon as it's finished, you need to hit to save it. Okay, cool. Yes, and guys, Nothing But Pixies is there, Buzz Cut Feed. These are great uh, platforms for all things uh, hair and inspiration and stylus and products. Uh, definitely, definitely um, follow them. Uh, in particular, Nothing But Pixies uh, have been, you know, incredible supporters of Shiva from the very beginning. So I'm, I'm immensely grateful for their support. Um, and buzz cut feed also. Um, thanks guys. And you've been working uh, with my management as well and just you know trying to see where this project's going to go. Um, so today was a big day to sort of turn the corner. Will Serena get shaved next? Oh yes. Serena! Yes! yes. Uh, Serena you're up honey. It's your turn. Oh no, it'll take a bit of convincing. Um, do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Really do, it. Just do, so? it. do it. Do you know? Here's a fun, <laughs> a fun, a fun fact. Serena has shaved before, actually, many, many years ago, a few times. There oh, yeah, you go. I so remember. she, yeah. So it's it's not it's new. That she knew Yeah, it was. Um, I did the Mila Jovovich look. Yep. Did it orange? Did it red? You look like her, actually. Do people say that? A bit. Yeah, you look like her. Um, Let's see. I'm gonna get my hair done tomorrow. Nice. And the boys are setting up at the back there for this shoot that's coming. You should see the uh, all of the outfits. They're incredible. Actually, I'm gonna take this moment to let you know who we're working with. Um, there's gonna be lots of brands in the coming weeks, but. Today, uh, I get the privilege of wearing some incredible suits by um, a brand called Q Menswear that are based here in Singapore and just a beautiful team of people up there. Uh, so warm and um, accommodating and encouraging and just keen to get on board. Uh, so you're going to see uh, some of their looks, um, some of their designs that they have we're going to use today in the shoot. Um, so yeah, I think they're also online. Are they on Instagram? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so you can follow Q them. Q Menswear Official. And of course, Jerry, uh, Jerry's handle. What's your handle again, Jerry? Remind me. Mainman149. 
Mean Man 149. Some people are saying join the team, Serena. I think it's oh. a great idea. Yes. <laughs> She'll get you in on board too. We'll see. Yeah. <laughs> Be a straight sh shave. Yeah, we like to sort of change it up a bit now. We've done the full shave. So let's see what we're going to do today. Your head shape is so nice. Yeah, the head shape is beautiful. And yes, for those of you who have been asking, the color is natural. This is <laughs> the color, guys. There's been nothing added to this. We can thank my parents. We can thank my dad, actually. We are vibrant red. Beautiful. You have to do a shoot with your brother, shape. Yeah, oh, yeah. Mm. Twins. Yeah, yeah, guys, I'm a twin. Someone says, Jerry, you can push the clippers unguarded into Sheba's forehead. <laughs> 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 what? What? Are these people your friends? Her fans. <laughs> yeah. We're working on our friendships. Yeah. <laughs> I think the way to reassess. Yeah. <laughs> How many of you guys have had a shaved head before? Put, uh, comment exactly. below if you have shaved your head before. In particular, girls, yeah? I think it's, you know, you've got to be a bit ballsy. You've got to be like strong and confident to just sort of try it out. It's so cute, all your little hairs over there. <laughs> it's the color. Yeah. Someone says, oh, now. She knows that you speak the truth about your beautiful red hair. Oh, there you go. Is there any hair left, Jerry? Oh, yeah. A yeah, yeah. <laughs> little bit. Still there. Okay. Because I've heard that sound for a long time. It's not even the shortest here. Yeah. I know you. Yeah. There is a gut. We might go even further. Ah? Yes. Yes. Let's do the overall shape first, yeah? Sure. So you have some questions. Okay. okay. Pass this back to you. Sure. Okay. Okay, guys. What have we got? My girlfriend shaped her head a year after I did it. Oh, nice. Went skin bald. So should you. Ooh. I don't know if I'm so like, oh. Yeah, we'll think about that one. Uh, was your hair previously the longest you've ever grown it? Good question. Uh, I think I've had slight, actually, no, I had longer the first time I cut, maybe slightly longer. Um, but yeah, my hair takes a long time to grow. I don't know. Maybe, yeah, it's slow. Um, Thank you, David. Yes, you rock any hairstyle. I actually feel like some people have a face that they can sort of pull off many hairstyles. What do you think, Jerry? Is that sort of true? Some people can... Definitely. Yeah? So you one of them. Mm. There you go. Okay. Yeah, actually, throughout my life, people have always said 
that I could wear all sorts of hats and all sorts of sunglasses because I had a good face shape yeah, actually that's for a, that. That's a good gauge. People yeah? who wear caps or hats yeah. look nice in it. Yeah. I think they can look nice in those haircuts. Right. Okay. And I feel like I've done majority of all the haircuts available to any female human. <laughs> um, you've had straight, curly, long, short, pixie bangs. Oh, I'm a big, I love bangs, full bangs, long full bangs. Some people don't like them. Um, thank you. Your favorite hairstyle ever? Favorite hairstyle ever, David? That's a great question. I feel like different sides of my personality come out with different cuts. So I noticed when I sort of was in a pixie cut um, after the head shape last time, I felt very, very feminine with that, which is strange because it was very short. But I felt like when I played with different looks of makeup, uh, it was very soft. I really enjoyed that. When I've obviously always been known for my very big, curly red hair. So, um, and I'm sort of effervescent as a person. So that kind of matched. Then when I've been really short or shaved, that was definitely the strongest I felt as, as a woman, you know. Um, there's power in that look, I think. Um, and it sort of translates a different vibe. Not that it's a different person, but a different side, you know, we're multifaceted. Um, so I enjoyed that. And I just felt really ready for a change. We knew we wanted to embark on, um, you know, me returning to the industry, and just waiting for exactly the perfect time for it all to piece together. And um, it happened, we knew we wanted a fresh look, we knew Sheba, uh, we wanted her return to just be you know, bold and edgy um, and just have some trademark looks, you know, that we could always attribute to Sheba. So that's what we've kind of been building on and just finding things that, that uh, represent me, parts of, you know, the voice that I want to have as we as we build this platform. And I just wanted it to be one. As you know, I've had life experience over the last seven years. Um, I've sort of been out of the industry for seven years, so it's just sort of cool to come back with a fresh new look, a fresh vibe, a fresh vision. And it's all very aligned now, so that's really cool. Um, Pixie Cut is very feminine. To, yeah. Um, yeah, so uh, that is how I feel about the upcoming project. Um, we're really excited about it. We think it's going to blossom. And there's something to be said about waiting for the right time, you know, divine time to embark upon something because. We can do a lot of stuff in our own strength, you know, but if it's not meant to be, it's going to be a rough journey as you sort of challenge and charge ahead. And, and now all the pieces have really come together. Um, so it's going to be a lot of logistics, um, getting everything together. If we're on the road, we're going to have to travel for shoots, that kind of thing. Um, but the time is right. Well, you know what's cool, guys? If we did do a pixie today, that leaves the window open, the door open, leaves the door open for us to do a second hair transformation, right? So, I mean, we're only just starting to become friends, so I feel like we need another date to establish our friendship. <laughs> So maybe, maybe that'll be based around a pair of clippers as well. I don't know. Um, but no, we just wanted, we knew today we wanted a fresh, edgy look, something that we haven't done before. Um, and that's what we're going to get. Um, just, you know, get some cool um, images, some cool content. 
you get to see that kind of side of Sheba that's a bit. There's some words for Sheba, Serena. She's powerful. She's bold. She's bold. Street, strong. Yeah. Powerful. True. Yeah, and I think the way we choose to style ourselves or style our hair really can influence um, the way we are perceived. Um, the message that we want to bring, I think that's also something. Um, it can sort of add, add to it. Now, Jerry, what are we doing here? What is this called? This is called, is this like a specific style of cutting right now? No, we just sort of, just layering it, taking away some of the right. extra length away first. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Before deciding whether to go short term. Uh-huh. Oh. So Jerry here is not even sure what they where he's going and he's just sort of feeling it out. Yep. Yep, seeing what we get. Bold and bold, hey. Okay. It's a good one. Yeah, so many of you have asked before where I'm from. I'm Australian. I was born and bred in Australia. And then I moved to Singapore when I was 18 years old um, and have been based here ever since. I've worked sort of around uh, Southeast Asia and abroad. Um, but essentially, home is here. Um, and I love it here. Uh, I mean, part of my heart's in Australia, but definitely home is Singapore. And um, I think, though, you know, sheep is going to have to sort of get on the road a little bit. Do you think, Serena, do you think we'll be heading away a bit? We'll be traveling for sure. Asia, yeah. America, South America, who there knows? You know. So all those people out there that would think this kind of look suits their campaign, we know who to get in contact with, and that is my amazing manager who is a great source of inspiration for me as an artist, as a person. I admire her immensely. Okay, now, wow, what's going to happen here? That's good. Let's cut feed. What time is it for you? You're America, right? So it's like, it's be like 3 a.m. in the morning or something for you. Which part of America? I don't know. I don't know where they're based. a big difference in um, hair between, say, like Caucasian hair, Asian hair. Is oh, yeah, for sure. You have to cut it differently. Definitely. Yeah. Um, difference in the density, right. color, texture. Mm -hmm. Like for Asians, Asians' hair is really uh, stiff. Right. Yeah. Not much movement, so you have to create. Yeah. As for Caucasian hair, it's different. It's lots of movement. Sometimes you have to tone it down a little bit. Mm. Oh wow, guys! 4:25 a.m. Oh, Canada, 11:30 at night. West Coast, 8:25. Okay, so John, we're we're being decent for you guys, huh? <laughs> Obviously, we planned around you. It was your schedule, John. Um, 1.30 Argentina. Wow, we're really coming in from all corners of this amazing planet that we live on. Ah! <laughs> I'm awake because... Of, 
Wow, guys, thanks! <laughs> okay, heads up. A live can only go for 60 minutes. It will just stop. Thank you, thank you. Are we near 60 minutes? No idea. Okay, we will start another one. <laughs> Part two. Part two. Mexico, 10.30. I believe when you were in discussion with Serena originally on this project, you were strictly told, do not make her look like an auntie. So, <laughs> today's the day to prove that I do not walk out of here like an auntie. For sure. Uh, no, thank you. Like I tell most of my clients, I don't even make aunties look like aunties. <laughs> well said. be cool with your curls as well. I'm gonna be doing straight on it. Yeah. Yeah. The whole trick is to make the movement of the hair come up. Mm. And then we shall play with that. Mm. Got a feeling maybe at 30-ish minutes. Okay, cool. Yes, you are my technical advisor. Thank you. We actually need that. Yes. Now, guys, some people um, that have been following Sheba for a really long time, uh, Nothing But Pixies is one of them. And uh, I've been blessed to be able to you know, work alongside them a little bit. And we look forward to more opportunities to collaborate. Um, and it's kind of... It's, it's so surreal, right? They're in America, we're here, and and yet we've, we've formed quite a tight bond um, over the years. So thanks thanks for that. Um, and now we what time is Serena's course. haircut? Oh, gosh. Oh, Serena, really? <laughs> You're next. <laughs> I can put a chair next to me. I can chair my chair. <laughs> You're not letting it go on. <laughs> She's next, guys. Uh, let's just say, I don't know, one thirty. She'll be up. Yeah. I'm game. She's game. Yeah. I'm going to cut my hair tomorrow, actually. Yeah. And dye it. Yeah. I thought you just had a haircut. Yeah, I want to go something. Oh. There we go. Uh -uh. Serena, come and show us now. She wants to get a haircut, guys. So you can comment below what you think she should get done. Fishman. She wants to, what do you want to do? Go short, shorter? Yeah. Maybe 